there's one thing I learned, then it's that we glow up. It's not glamorous. Moment of truth, I'm going to wash my eyebrows. I hate it. Strokes. I see something different about my hair. What the f? You know those days where you're like, I feel amazing. Yeah, I can't relate today. I feel like absolute sh So I thought it was time to do a glow up. So I'm taking you guys with me to like my outer glow up, everything that I do to feel better in a day kind of thing. Um, on the outside, so like tan, whiten my teeth, do my skincare, hair care, whatever. And then also a bit on the inside because that needs a bit of glowing up as well. And I'm taking you guys with me to my bathroom. Alrighty, so we're now in my bathroom and I actually made a list, a to-do list of my glow up. So first step is hydration. I'm still at 8 a.m. and it's now 5 p.m. So that's going great. Then next, exfoliate everything, shave everything. Laser, tone hair, scalp mask, hair mask, tan, then again lol, wax brows, paint brows, face mask, eye mask, lip scrub, whiten teeth, and then the internal glow up. So we have a bit of a to-do list, so let's get started. Update from the bath. I'm actually feeling a lot better already. The water is green, which is kind of putting me off, but it's fine. I have my water here. I'm still at 8 a.m., so that's not going great, but I'll make up for it. And now it is time to exfoliate. And I just go and like search for the motions. Step two, shaving. So I feel like, like a snake, I like shed four layers of fake tan with the exfoliation, which was nice. Now it is time to get rid of some hair and then we're going to laser. <laughs> going to laser and for that we need this one which is not an ad it's the brown silk bird pro 5 5 pro 5 i have an opvlieger i can't i have like a heat attack from the bath Ooh. okay so i finished with step number three lasering i'm going to laser my armpits but i'm not going to show it because that's a bit weird i think and then i'm going to check my list because i forgot what the next step is but i'm excited because i already feel a bit better it's time to tone this hair which is long overdue because my goal is that i look orange or like tanned whatever but my hair is the one that is looking orange now which is not the vibe i was going for it's also super greasy so i need to wash it but first i'm going to tone it so Going to find a toner. Found it. Five to 20 minutes. Apply on clean hair. Um, that is an issue because I have been postponing washing my hair because I don't want to wash my hair often. So I feel like if I wash it now and then apply the toner and then wash it again, my hair will get used to being washed frequently. And I just got those extra days in. So I'll apply it on dirty hair and we'll see how it goes, fingers crossed. Might be a bad move, but maybe not. Remember from last time that this stuff is pretty like potent. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, maybe I should have done this in the bathroom. Too late now. I can already tell that I don't have enough. Brad Mondo, whatever his name is. Don't come at me, please. If there's one thing I learned, then it's that the glow up is not glamorous. Now I'm going to comb through. Probably should have brushed my hair first. This is not working. I thought maybe combing would help with distributing the product, but I don't think, I don't think it's helpful. I feel like I'm glowing down instead of glowing up because my nails are now purple and my hands are kind of purple as well. I don't even know if you can see it. At least I know that the toner is working. But next step is to wax, is to wax my brows. Ooh. I just noticed that I have toner everywhere in my neck. Okay, so I'm just going to do a bit more underneath and then I'll be back to paint my brows. Okay, so I'm going to apply these two. It's actually like beard dye. I read online that that was like, oh shit. Okay, maybe it's like outdated. 
going to apply the dye. I'm kind of scared, but we'll see. I guess I'm just going to go like this. That looks orange to me. I feel like that's already dark. I'm going to put a timer at two minutes and we'll see. And I'm going to clean up the rest of the brow. I feel like it's super dark already. <laughs> Maybe I should like take it off. It's just brows. <laughs> I'm like kind of regretting my decision to do like a glow up. Oh my God, it's getting darker as I look at it. Moment of truth, I'm going to wash my eyebrows. Okay, no, I actually think they're fine. I think they're fine. I, I think they're fine. In case you're wondering, I used the dark brown beard guy for my eyebrows. Next step, I need to look at my phone again because I forgot. I am in the kitchen because I'm going to do a face mask and I need to prepare it. This is the one. It's called the Indian Healing Clay and I need to mix it up. He's looking at me. What are you doing? I know it's weird. Like this is a good look. I can't really move my face anymore. <laughs> this mask is getting so tight. Um, but that is why I was thinking maybe it's a perfect time to apply whitening strips. I'm just doing my bottom, my crease on the top. I completely forgot about my toner. <laughs> I don't know how long that has been in for, but it kind of has like a purplish tint. Oops. But my dog needs to go on a walk. So I took my mask off. It was like burning and I still have my strip. <laughs> so hopefully I won't run into anyone. Quickly applying a serum. Okay. Ready to walk the dog. Okay, I'm walking the dog and I actually forgot that I need to take these strips out. Okay, little update. I got the strips out. Um, I kind of still feel the stickiness. I don't think I've updated you about my skin yet, but honestly, my skin feels super clean. So I'm going to apply a mask. I'm going to apply this one for my scalp from Kiehl's. And I'm going to apply this one in my hair, which is just like a random one. Okay, you're just going to see the back of my head real quick. And so I can see what I'm doing. This one, it's like um, a little lip scrub, obviously, by Rituals, just like a sugar scrub. And then I'm going to apply my favorite lip mask, which is this one by Laneige. Laneige? Laneige? I don't know. And then I'm going to tan, which I'm really excited for. And then the lip mask. Time to tan. I just applied the tiniest bit of moisturizer on my knees and on my ankles, like all the dry patches basically. Some tan. I'm using the Loving Tan in Ultra Dark. And then I'm going to apply the tan like upward strokes. And that's it. Good morning, resty next day. I need to take a shower because my tan is looking quite tan, a bit orange. And I used this last night to tan my face. Can we please focus? Focus. This one.
Good morning, Nabil. Good I morning. have a question. Yeah. I see something different about my hair. What the f I don't even know if you're in frame. Like, I'm not the one who should be filming. Wait, is this supposed to be gray? Yeah, well, no. It was supposed to be, like, ashy blonde. She has pink hair. She has pink hair. It's the glow up. You know what, guys? The real glow up is always from the inside out. That's, that's the one thing that counts. So I'm going to do a workout because I always feel 10 times better after I finish a workout. And today we're training hamstrings and glutes from my shred guide. So I'll pop the workout in the screen right now. If you want to go ahead and join me, then you can. We finished our glow up transformation, but I wanted to end the video by saying that honestly the biggest difference is whatever makes you happy. So for me, I just love going to the gym. I love moving my body. I love spending time with fun people and laughing. And that honestly always makes me feel the absolute best. That being said, I also love a little bit of like maintenance. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for spending time with me and then I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.